Chef Buck here and today, you know, I'm cooking up a simple pasta salad. You know, that doesn't sound very exciting and it's not very exciting, but you know, you can have too much excitement in your life. Sometimes you just need to back off, you know. But I'm using Israeli couscous for this, pearl couscous. Uh, I was looking for regular couscous a few months ago. You know, I buy it in bulk and they didn't have it in bulk, so I thought I'd give this a try. You know, and I like it. You know, I've used it several times over the past few months. You know, I find this makes a fantastic pasta salad because it's basically a small pasta, which couscous is, but this is a little bigger than couscous. You basically just boil up some water, throw your couscous in there, cover it up, let it simmer away for about 10 minutes, you know, and then it's going to look like this. Boom, it's kind of freaky looking. Reminds me of a David Lynch movie. But don't be hypnotized by that. You know, you got to get it off the heat. You know, because you want to stop the cooking process. So I'm going to run some uh, cold water on here so that it doesn't get overcooked and get sticky and mushy. And then that's basically it. You know, we're done with the couscous for now. So we'll just uh, throw together our other salad ingredients. And I like to use a little bit of cucumber, but I always use the uh, thin-skinned English cucumber or Japanese cucumber. You know, some kind of cucumber like that. That you don't have to skin it because the skin has a great color adds a great crunch you know and they just taste fantastic you know those big old hulking water filled cucumbers man and I'm not gonna bad you know I don't want to bad mouth the watery cucumbers you know but I, I got enough I, I don't care for them you know try the you know these are a little more expensive but they're worth it you know so try uh, an English or Japanese style uh, cucumber and here's a little tip for you this is my lemon zester and I'm gonna use it to make uh, carrot strings look how cute that is you know is this labor intensive maybe <laughs> but you know it's nice to have uh, different shapes and sizes in a salad because a salad can be boring you know so those those different uh, shapes and sizes can make a salad more interesting or at least as interesting as a salad can get now I'm just gonna do a basic uh, salad dressing here a little bit of lemon juice and uh, olive oil uh, I'm gonna throw in some uh, minced ginger and garlic a little salt and pepper if you don't want to use fresh lemon juice uh, substitute vinegar but if you do use uh, lemon juice make sure you use that lemon zest you know don't waste that zest you can throw it in with the dressing or you can just toss it in uh, when you throw your salad ingredients all together which I'm doing here so boom there goes my lemon zest my carrot strings I'm gonna throw my cucumber in there and camera girl she likes cilantro you know but I like uh, parsley with this dish so I throw in a bunch of parsley and I got in trouble for that but I'm making this salad you know so I can do that and trouble's my middle name anyway so I'm very comfortable uh, with that now this here's a little celery just for crunch you know basically I'm cleaning out the fridge you know and this is all I threw in here you know I'm tossing it together you know what really would have gone well in here is a little bit of red bell pepper for color but I went ahead and added some uh, cherry tomatoes but I didn't put them in uh, when I was making the salad because I knew this was a lot of salad I wasn't going to eat it all so I just added the cherry tomatoes later when I was going to eat it because you don't want to re refrigerate tomatoes if you can avoid it because you know once you refrigerate tomatoes they kind of suck now this uh, pasta salad is great as a side dish but as you can see I'm throwing it on some arugula some arugula I don't like to say that word but uh, boom this was my lunch very healthy good for me I'm trying to make more decisions like this but it's still not the norm but you know if you've never tried pearl couscous then definitely give it a go you know it makes a great pasta salad give this recipe a go let me know what you think thanks for watching sharing and liking the video and doing all that super duper stuff and I'll see you in the future